Hi, this is John Marling, Pulse Research. Appreciate you taking the time to take a look at this little video explaining and showing you some of the functionality and opportunities with the Top 50 Ad Seller Program. And what the Top 50 Ad Seller Program is based upon is the most sold 50 business categories by ad reps all across North America. And that they're from over 600 papers and in total about 7,000 ad reps who are using the program. And this is the top 50. Let's take a look. So if you'd like to uh, follow along, go to PulseResearch.com. You'll have a username and password. And if you want to go to the demo site, just type in JM Top 50, JM Top 50. So let's take a look at the top 50 most sold business categories. Okay, And we'll show you a little bit about how you can use the program to get additional advertising. So once you log in, I would suggest you go to the prospects and here is the list of the top 50 business categories. And also in the information for each business category is the close ratio and the average sale and the sold rank. And so in this list here, you're getting the aggregate, the combined of multiplying the close ratio and the average sale and the sold rank. To look at the pure top 50 list, just click on sold rank, and there it is, 1 through 50. If you want to know which has the highest average sale, click here. If you want to know which has the highest close ratio, click on the close ratio column. So let's take a look at the top 50, starting out with realtors. Who would have thought that? Then new vehicle dealership, family style restaurant, furniture store, etc. For each of the business category, there's a little teaser. Now the teaser, we'll just click here on realtor is some talking points based on your circulation on the opportunity for that business category of your audience in terms of how many potential customer households and how much will be spent. It's a great way to get an appointment, to start a dialogue, to break the ice because it's about and for their business. You'll notice here for many business categories it says example. We've created for you an example presentation. So all an ad wrap has to do is just click on example and it pre-populates a presentation for you. So let's show you now how fast you can create a presentation with your top 50 ad seller program. You come over here and you click on find and when your program is set up it'll default to your geographic area. And this is a Google mashup and you can change the zip code here or put in a community name to really fine tune the results. And so you come down here, we clicked on Furniture Store. Let me show you how fast you can create a furniture store presentation for, let's say, Sherman's Furniture. So you just click on Record Presentation. You click on One Page. It's a beautiful, little, simple one-page presentation. You click on Audience, and we'll put in your Audience option for you. Then you click on Ad Package. You enter your custom ad package. And let's say we're going to present a $12,000 package for 52 weeks. Then in the setup, you'll notice there's an average value, customer value, and that's for a year's time. And Pulse gives you the average household spending for each one of the 50 business categories. <clears throat> you'll see it's a 50% gross profit. That's used as just a placeholder because we want to get the business's input on what their gross profit is. Now the next step in the setup, click on products and services, and your ad rep can select, once again, from the research. And this is the Pulse of America shopping research. We did it in early February, so the results are very current. And it gives, over for these 50 business categories, the percent who plan to shop, plus the products and services you know, relating to their business. So like with a furniture store, 11.1% of the from the February National Pulse of America survey said they're going to buy living furniture. Wow, let's click on that. Home decor, 10%. Outdoor furniture, 10.3%. Recliner chair, probably interest, pretty much pretty interested in that. Bedroom furniture, rugs. What about mattresses? Well, just type in mattress. And here are the mattress uh, information purchasing is a pillow top mattress. Let's include that. So we click finish on the uh, setup of the products and services. Now let's show them what they're missing if they say, well, you know, we've got a Facebook page, we don't need you. Okay? So Business Facebook offer, 90% haven't used. Well, i got our own website we don't need you. 57% haven't used a local business website. Well, I use direct mail, 77% have not used. Well, what about Google search? We'll come down here, and let's take a look at retail businesses. Okay, 
coming down here, furniture store, perfect. So we've got Google search in the options. Then next, we click on return on investment. We click the other $12,000 campaign. Boy, I'd be really happy with a 10 time return or 120,000, wouldn't you? So just type in 120,000. Also in the research, Pulse of America is ad readership information. And that's it, it's as simple as that to set up a presentation. So click on save. And here is a one page presentation that shows the advertiser what the opportunities are for their business. Starting out with, look at this, 18.9% plan to shop at a furniture store. Once again, that's from the Pulse of America newspaper shopping research. The audience in this example is 28,852 with print and web unduplicated. That means there's over 5,200 households that are going to shop at a furniture store at $900 each. Wow, that's almost $5 million. Now let's talk about where the business can get more revenue. That's about what this is about, is finding solutions for the business. The gentleman might say, oh my gosh, look at that. There's almost 3,000 households who are going to buy outdoor furniture. I should be probing to that. Oh my gosh, look at rugs, over 3,500. That's a great opportunity for growth for us. Well, I use Facebook. I don't need you. Look at this, 90%. If you put that rug special on your Facebook page, 90% of our audience would not uh, see that business Facebook offer, okay? Well, what about Google search? 91% would be missed. And look at this, all you need is just 27 customers to pay for the campaign. That's at a $900 value, an estimated gross profit of 50%. But I'll show you in just a second with a mobile presentation how you can get the advertiser input, okay? So that's a printed one-page presentation. Now the option that I would recommend is a mobile presentation on a smartphone or a tablet. So we just click on mobile presentation here. We show them 18.9% are going to shop at a furniture store. Here's our distribution net. That's over 5,200 households at $900 each. That's $4.7 million of opportunity. 1% is almost 50,000. What do you think you can get? Well, I think I can get a 3% share. So you just click there and you type in 3%. Look at that almost 150,000. Now let's work with the business. It's about finding solutions for the business. Here's what's going to be bought by our audience. The number of households who are going to buy. Where do you think you can get more? Well, I think I can get more rugs. I think I can get more outdoor furniture, okay? But what other mattress information do you have? Well, you just click here and with the business, you can access shopping information for mattresses. And look at this, he says, well, I want to know about foam mattresses. And I want to have information on the opportunity for gel mattresses. You click on that. He says, but also, wow, this is great. I love information about my business. How about hot tubs? Okay, so you type in hot tubs. Okay, new hot tubs, used hot tubs. Anything else you're interested in? Yeah, I'd be very, very interested in information on freezers. So we type in freezer. Look at that. Boom, right at your fingertips. Now your ad reps can be a true consultant. So you click on finish. Now, look at their report. They've got all the information about where they can get more. Then you click next. We show them what they're missing. Then we click again, and we can show them in the campaign uh, how you, uh, the, what we're going to propose. By the way, if you've got a Metro Graphics Ad Wizard program, there's a link to the Metro Graphics Ad Wizard program. Now let's show them how few customers they need to pay for the campaign. So just 27 customers for a consistent 52-week campaign. And let's work with them to, to, with their input, what's comfortable for them, okay? So now we click on the edit pen. What's your customer worth? Well, my customer's worth around $1,200, okay? And what's your gross profit? About 65%, okay? So that means that their average customer is $780. So in a consistent campaign. What's the minimum amount of customers you think you'd get? Click here, and he says, boy, I think I could get on a minimal basis, I think 18, one every other, I mean, two, one and a half per month. And look at that. So 18 customers over 52 weeks at 780, it's a $14,000 campaign that you're comfortable with. Guy says, yeah, that's great, because now he sees the opportunity, he understands consistency is important. He sees what he's missing if he doesn't advertise with you also. And he realizes he just needs 18 customers at his gross profit number to pay for the campaign. 
So that's an overview of the Top 50 Ad Seller Program. If you've got any questions, comment, or like more information, it's Marlin, M-A-R-L-I-N-G, at paper.net. Or give me a call, 503-784-5772. Thanks a lot.